Does it look familiar to you? I'm not in Citizen 1. Citizen 1 is just opposite. This is Citizen 2, the younger brother of Citizen 1, also done by the same developer, Ben Astra. So if you have view Citizen 1, Citizen 2 shouldn't be unfamiliar to you. The setup here is pretty similar. Also 3 block, I think about 800 over units. 2 types of layout, just 2 types, 700 over and 850. So 700 is 2 bedroom, 850 is 3 bedroom. So 2 bedder, 1 car park, 3 bedder, 2 car park. Okay, simple right? So 3 blocks, all the facility will be in between the blocks, something like this. Same thing like Citizen. So if you are going from Sunway direction, you just take NPE to go to Citizen 2. So just now we are cutting in to NPE from the Federal Highway. So just one to two minute drive, you can see Citizen 1 and Citizen 2 already. So from here, you take Jalan Templar. Just follow to the left lane. If you go up, it will go to places like Bangsa, Mid Valley, Bangsa South. If you go down, you can go to uh, the PJ Old Town, Citizen 1, Citizen 2, Petals. So you turn left, you can go to PJ area, then just go straight, you can go to Oakland Road. And then underneath this ramp, right, you can go to Citizen 1, Citizen 2, and also this is Petals. So what is the accessibility benefits in Citizen 1, Citizen 2 and Petals? Because it can use this one. This is an NPE. The NPE, that means you can go to Sunway, Subang. Uh, you can go to PJ area where you can straight away connect to Federal Highway. Then you can go to PJ Old Town area. Of course, go straight all the way is you are going to Old Clang Road. So if you go straight, you can go to Jalan Puchong and also Old Clang Road whereby you turn left, you can go to Mid Valley, turn right, you can go to Puchong. We got to go in front to the Jalan Puchong area to make a U-turn to turn into Citizen 1. Okay, this is Arena by Platinum. So next door is a Citizen 2. So we need to go to all the way in front and then we make a U-turn. This is Skyview Benteng 8. So yeah, if you are really familiar with this area, right in front street, all the way right, there will be a Asset Kaya Mas project coming up. Yeah, the hoarding is already there. Asset Kaya Mas Harmony. This is one of the most affordable new launch. That would be, I think, Bliss. And then on here, after we U-turn, right, you see Arena. Then next to Arena is Citizen 2. So we got to make a left turn over here. Yeah, you can see Arena Club by Platinum Victory. This front side is a uh, Petals by Axim. So after BHP, if you're coming from like Mid Valley, Oak Lang Road, right after BHP, you go all the way straight, all the way straight, and then just follow the left. There will be a road to turn in. Yes, this is the road. Then we turn in here. On my right is Citizen 1. On my right is Citizen 1. And on my left is Citizen 2. There's a lot of car here. That means they are already taking their keys. Full house. So I'm going to find a visitor car park. I think the nearest undercon is this one, Arena, this whole Platinum Victory. This year, I think end of last year or this year, they launched this uh, Arena, uh, not Arena, I said Kayama's Harmony, which we just saw the hoarding just now. And then KFC, this one should be Residence 8. This one should be the Nest, Oakland Road. This one should be Bloomsville. Next to Bloomsville should be Tiara Mutiara 1 and 2. And then that green color, orange color should be OUG Park Lane. And then the rest of it lah. So this area you can see a little bit purplish. I'm not sure you can see or not. 
this building is uh, Casa Green then the orange color highlight there right with all the windows glass on that one is uh, Z Residence by Trinity so it's Casa is by Amber then next to Z is uh, the range by Exim and of course that that will be Bukit Jaleo area already uh. so that way you can actually visualize that that is a Kasas Highway down there uh, you cannot see this is Jalan Puchong so you go straight all the way go to Mid Valley, Bangsa, Taman Desa, Kuchai then from this way you can go to NPE, Sunway, Subang, uh, PJ area go this way go to Puchong and all the way is the IOI area already uh. so it's right, pretty convenient what I mean by citizen one this but there's no unit actually facing citizen one area has been provided okay pretty standard pretty standard yeah provided and then this is like solid surface solid surface something similar to citizen one very alike because you also have crystal cost water element then uh, reflectology areas you can feel the wind it's very windy over here just sit here and enjoy today it's not so sunny so it's like not so hot to shoot the playground there's playground at ground floor and also a playground at facility floor so facility, this is artificial grass. So you have sauna, male, for female. It's a bit noisy here because arena is still under construction. Easy to play for badminton. Of course, you can also play at the in-house court. So we have crystal court in the condo. So footstool court is between block B and block C. Opposite is citizen one. I think this is block C B as well. So if one court is not enough, you have another court here located at block B. So you have another court here, tall enough that you serve high. So this is between block B and block A water features. Then here we have the uh, outdoor gym. Uh, we have hammock. Is it called hammock? So this is like the relaxing path. Maybe cute kids you can come here to have family gathering. The garden furniture is provided. Like wow. Well, can just cook here. I think they need to like cook. So these areas are so many greens. So relaxing. Although it's a condo, they put in a lot of greeneries. Another nice corner here. To just enjoy like having tea time over here and then garden furniture enjoy the greenery huh? but on this part is a little bit noisier because it's facing the front part so front part got NPE highway man. where does this lead to okay block A has its own advantage Block A has the pool. So actually they have two pools. One in level 8 and one I think is level 2 or 3 maybe. I'm not sure so later let's go down and have a look. Refills for the package pool. Got double door so that the smell doesn't seep out. 
so they can wash over here there's a floor track pretty basic but good enough and then ventilation is good and then this is like i think fiber cable i think that's why they lock it then yeah not bad and then it's like ventilation So this is the refuge room, so one door, two door, three door. So even outside here, so you won't smell the rubbish. So the leaf is over here. The leaf is over here, you share this leaf. This leaf bomba. So swimming pool, 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. daily. Can come here to enjoy. You can see here, right, they have this special leaf this leaf can go to i think another facility level it's pretty cool right you don't need to go back into that area into the area where we came from you can just use the facility leaf it's pretty cool actually not many condos offer facility leaf right? just three condos then we go in go down let's say we go to second floor not sure is this second floor so now we are at eighth floor so i think this one can go to car park certain level car park 7b and then maybe second floor is another swimming pool let's have a look okay here we are yeah second floor second floor is the next pool so if you think that it's too crowded during the social distancing era you can come over here, enjoy your what, jacuzzi and then of course this one you can swim because the good thing is that it's shaded so during rain also you can swim and most of the condo only provide one level of facility that this one got two a children's pool some more then you have another bbq kit over here this is level two so it's pretty well taught very spacious area not hard to maintain because like there's not much of like fancy fancy designs over in the condo so have a look i think this fits to the gym let's go up and have a look Yeah, this is a gym. Can we enter? Okay, let's. Oh, it's locked. One more time. Okay, it's locked. So the gym has like three weights, a uh, bench. I think there's a sandbag. Um, multi press. treadmill 2 oh treadmill 4 cycle got 2 and 2 more over here try this as well see whether we can enter or not one more time yeah cannot enter so this is flood gym 7 a.m to 7 p.m then that's the facility Right, you can just enter from the car park area, go straight to the facility lift. So one of the additional things that they provided in this development. Usage or oh, need to submit reservable and then opening hours 9 to 10. Not bad. Lah. Wow, you can do KTV some more. Chong K away. Can sing K. Where's the, where's the, where's the, where's the, where's the, like. Wow. 
not set up yet, I think. Wow, Pro KTV, I hide the K. So this is a 850 square feet, three bedder unit. So on the left is the bathroom. Then is the second room. This already comes with the light point, fan point, and then the aircon. So pretty much, I don't see any major defects, no water stain. This has been given, this one, and then shower. So shower screen has been given, shower set has been given. On the living room, we have this dining counter with the same sink tap, deca. Is this an oven? I think it should be an oven. Hood hop, slim hood. Then deca hot. So this is deca hood. Has been provided like a uh, kitchen cabinet. I think this one, can I open this? Okay. Oh, okay. I think they didn't provide this one. This one should be uh, like a lock because if this one, right, this one should actually bounce out, my right? Okay. Then this one, yep. So this is your fridge area. Uh, let's go to have a look at the yard area. You, so yard area, you can see. So most of the units actually comes with aircon already. Panasonic as aircon. So this area is washing machine, the plug point, the water inlet, outlet, and then we go to there's an intercom. Okay, let's go and see the view of the balcony. All right, this unit has an unblocked view because it is facing to the southern part whereby you can see towards the Puchong area so that's why because here is like the court is already there landed this is up I think walk up apartments so there will be there will not be any blocking and then that area is a landed house also so there will not any blocking but if you are choosing like there's no unit facing to citizen one there's unit facing to the left, but the left, right, last time we know that there's an empty land here, ma. So chances that we recommend all the buyers actually buy this view. So this view, you can see, this totally unblocked view. Then this is Jalan Puchong all the way to Puchong area. This is the T junction where you can go to Old Glang Road and this area to come into Citizen 2. So arena still under construction, so unit facing to that side, block C will be nearer and then slightly noisier. Lor. Then we go to the unit again. This is the master room. So pretty standard. Aircon has been provided. Oh, there's an emergency here. Then... Uh, Yep, shower screen, WC be dead, then shower set. Okay. So, doorbell has been provided. Not bad if you really cook, right? Normally, developer will only give you the hook and also the hood. Man. So, very seldom you see developer also give this one. Then, and drawers are, uh, wow that's organizer properly catered for you already that's normally we don't actually cater then it's just normal yeah so it's pretty uh, practical already so you just need to buy your fridge your washing machine then of course your furniture because furniture is very subjective right so today we are looking at citizen 2 each floor got one, two, three, four, four leaves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine units. So four leaves for nine units. 
is about 40 floor. So that's like 41 floor and then every floor is like about 8 to 9 units. So about 200 over units. Total is about 800 over units here. Well, what I like is the facilities. Because despite this is about 400 over thousand property, one of the cheapest in Oakland Road three years ago. But of course now there is something similar like the police. Before that there's Nest Oakland Road and now they have this also next door Platinum Arena. But Platinum Arena is a leasehold property. So this is one of the most affordable, most affordable property options available three years back. So this is done by Bear Nastra. Opposite is uh, opposite is Petals Residence. Residence, I think Petals is selling about six hundred over thousand or seven hundred thousand onwards. And then during that time, one of my friend asked me, "Is there any affordable things and then really accessible to anywhere?" Because this is so strategically located in Go Klang Road, whereby you can go to Mid Valley, Bangsa Sao Bangsa, Taman Desa, Kuchai Lama, or even to Sunway area, Subang area, PJ area within just about 10 minutes or to 15 minutes. So with this price point, and of course I knew Benastra before that. I knew Benastra and how their track record of delivery. Because I have seen Cyber Square in Cyber Jaya, Green Residence in Cheras, and then I know Citizen One visited Citizen One during the VP time. One of my friends bought Citizen One, I think it's block A. I was thinking the facilities wise and the delivery is always on time. Facilities wise is always th thumbs up with that price. It's actually value for money. This project is just 400 over thousand up to 500 over thousand depend. There's only two layout, very simple. 725 I think, 725 and 850. So 700 over square feet is a two bader. 850 is a three bader. So three bader got two car park. One bay, uh, two bader got one car park. And of course, three blocks. At this price, you can't complain in terms of the density because it's just fair. I would say it's a decent number of density. And every floor is just like eight to nine units. Eight to nine units per floor. Although it has like 41 floor, it's understandable because due to the overall package, right? You have to see the overall package. You are not just buying because of the price. Mark. You can see the number of badminton court. Badminton court, I saw three. I think there's one more hidden inside by the wall. So there should be four badminton court, two swinging pool. Imagine that. And then facility, normally facility decks, uh, people only give you one floor man. this one like two floor level 8 and level 2 and then they have also facility lift directly to the car park and also directly to the facility how good is that way citizen one also have their facility lift that links to the car park and then go up to the facility level so this is their style this is also the facility lift so similarly there's a lot of green like citizen one also really put into consideration of having all these greens it makes it more relaxing when it comes back to home. For example, the one that we visited in Bangsa South, it is also next to the highway. You can hear to the sound, the more very similar feeling. This one also very windy, and then there's a lot of greeneries. But of course, Novum, it is like one bedroom or maybe studio unit, 600 square feet, uh, selling about 600,000. Location wise, is different. This one is at Oakland Road, and then it's just also similarly next to the highway, and then this is much more affordable much more affordable because it's 400 over thousand that is why a lot of the buyers are first home buyers three things that i like about this area the pricing is fair decent value for money second thing is accessibility because you can literally get to anywhere easily within 10 minutes really within 10 minutes if you don't believe you come here try to go to sunway subang pj bangsa south bangsa mid valley it's just literally about 10 minutes because it's right in the middle to this all this important location. So we want to go to Bangsa. How long is it? Now we are actually in Citizen 2. So Bangsa click about 10 plus minute. 14 ah. Then stop. Let's go to Bangsa South. 
about 14 minutes I stopped right in front of the Citizen 2 the Mid Valley Mega Mall 14 minutes we go to Sunway 10 minutes so you can see Citizen 2 is actually very strategic to go to anywhere meet all those working population area la, like Bangsa Bangsa South Mid Valley Oakland Road area Sunway so it's like around 10 minutes plus 15 minutes this is citizen 2 la. this is citizen 1 this is citizen 2 so right in front i route i route this thing it's just about merely 10 minutes 10 plus minutes you can reach to your destination because it's like in the central so in what's good about oakland road is like uh, it's very convenient not to get to anywhere or uh, there's no lrt mrt but not necessary to have mrt or lrt if you really can drive literally everywhere around 10 plus minutes imagine you are staying places like a little bit far lah say Rawang, uh, uh, Sungai Pulo, uh, Shah Alam, uh, Kota Kemuning uh. imagine you want to go to PJ, KL you want to go to places like Sunway, uh, Mid Valley how many minutes you need to drive easily probably half an hour right this one is just 10 plus minutes only that's why one of the major plus point that I like about Citizen apart from the developers track record of on-time delivery what they deliver is always okay i mean neutral okay not the fancy type not the luxury type but okay is the accessibility the location of this place because the third thing i like about this development is that it doesn't have a lot of things that you need to worry about in terms of the cons part right access road when you come from npe side right you need to make a u-turn slightly inconvenient Then second thing is because it's near to everywhere and then near to the highway also when it comes to convenience right it becomes a slight cons as well because it's too near to the highway that's why during that time i also analyze different blocks block a block b block c which is the block is near to the highway which is the block has an unblocked view then we recommend accordingly one of the best facing would be block c facing the southern direction because why in front there is all the low rise apartment the badminton court there then low rise or landed houses so chances of blocking view is very low so compared to the to the right side i think is towards the east i think towards the east there's a platinum arena to the front it's not blocked it's not blocked view uh petals that is not blocking to citizen two in front probably probably you will be hearing noises la, the car passing by then because it's literally next to npe ma. i like convenience so i don't really mind staying in the city and then it's very convenient for me to get to anywhere although there's like some people say uh, i must have mrt lrt but this area because i used to drive around also so this area is convenient enough for me to meet people in the middle middle point maybe mid valley bangsa or maybe in the pj area is also convenient whether i work in pj whether i work in kl kl i will just take the oakland road the jalan puchung all the way to mid valley and then straight away to kl if i were to go to work in pj or sunway right just go out from citizen to the this in front of the main road then just go straight take npe or federal highway this product is very alike citizen one just that citizen one is bigger units Citizen 2 is more affordable, smaller unit, 725 square feet to 850, just two type of layout. Very expected kind of delivery because it's on time and most of the time when it comes to facilities, you need to balance between fanciness and practicality. Ma. Because if it's like too fancy, it is hard to maintain. Hard to maintain, that means it's costlier to maintain. But if it's like too practical, then it will be too boring as well. Not innovative in terms of designing the development. Benashra is kind of well balanced in terms of fanciness because you can see their product is like white grey, dark grey, not much of like ages, curvature, uh, facilities is not super fancy. And then they still willing to provide them a lot of facilities. How many developments provide double level facilities? Eh? Normally provide two bad intern court enough already. Lor. This one I think got four. Leh. Block A has the pool to two both the pools block b and block c has a badminton court this is eighth floor we walk all the way went down for a while to see the swimming pool and then come back all the way here there's two badminton court over here so total got four courts done our shooting today 
So if you like the content that you are producing, please help us with two things, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye! -bye.